Welcome back. We're in the kitchen set with Terry Johnson, one of the creators of the Quirkles. And uh, before we get going on what's going on over here, talk about the Quirkles for people that don't know. Okay, the Quirkles is a 26-book science and literacy series. It's a way to get kids excited about science at an early age and uh, also keep the literacy piece with it. And where can people get these books from? Uh, they can get it from IPA, from Gold Mines, Anna Sophia's, and from our website, Quirkles.com. Okay, we are doing some Halloween experiments, obviously, here on the set yes. today. Got a pumpkin over here. What's going on today? Okay, I just wanted to show educators and parents that Halloween didn't have to be about all the gory, scary stuff that you see nowadays. It's a wonderful time to bring in your science piece and have a lot of fun. You can have a science party on Halloween instead of the, the scary party. No, now I'm no Tom Turton. I know this okay. is a jacket, but I'm no okay. Tom Turton. Okay, so okay, well, I'm going to guide you. This is going to be good. Okay. okay. The first thing I want to do is just to show you the jack o' lantern. My husband carved this last night, so he did a really good did job on job. that, didn't he? And I'm just going to take dry ice. Now, I already put the dry ice in here, but when you're handling dry ice, be sure and always wear gloves because it's very, very cold and it will actually burn you. Dry ice is carbon dioxide in the solid form, so when you put warm water, and it does need to be warm, you're going to get a reaction, actually sublimation, and I'm going to take wow. this and put it down in my pumpkin. Now, is that steam hot? Or is it cold? Or no, is it? it is not hot. It's cold. And I'm just going to put my lights down here, just these battery charged lights. And in a minute here, we are going to dim the lights. And as you can see, it makes your normal jack-o'-lantern into a fun science jack-o'-lantern that has smoke actually coming out of its mouth. Can we mouth. dim the lights so a little bit to see fun. the... Uh, well, we'll do that, I think, here. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, great. My bad. So I'm that's... jumping out of... And here, I just have dry ice in a tall cylinder. This is a uh, great cylinder for kids because they can't get their hands down in it. And again, dry ice should only be handled by adults, not right. by children. So we're going to pour the... Ooh. Oops, whoa, I got the it boiling all... boiling water all over my hands. <laughs> And to make it really spooky, I'm going to put atomic glow in here that we're going to put a black light on here in a minute after we make our worms. What is atomic glow? Atomic glow is a fluorescent dye that is activated by a black light, UV okay. black light. So when we, here in a minute, we're going to dim those black lights. So as you can see, and you can imagine the oohs and ahs that you're going to get from kids with this kind of thing. Absolutely. Now. You are going to make play. ooey gooey worms now, Rob. I what know. I'd like for you to do is to take your pitcher of water and pour about three-fourths cup full of water. And take this. This is actually, we're going to call it worm activator, but it's actually calcium chloride that you find in pickle juice okay. that makes a substance salty without adding the actual salt. So take that and stir that in. Stir it until it dissolves. And by the Here, way, I can I'm, make some too. While I'm stirring this, how long does this, does this steam and smoke uh, about, last? Well, it, it just depends on how much dry ice you have in there and how much because it, it's, it's actually turning from a, whoa, Oops. I just keep doing that. It's turning from a solid to a gas. Now you have that. We've got 30 resolved. seconds left, so can we, okay, can we get here those we lights go. down here? Now I want you to take this and kind of just pour it in there like you right are now? pouring, putting mustard on a hot dog. Swirl it around. Cool. Okay. That is sodium all allergate, and that turns it into from a liquid to a solid. Actually, it's a polymer. It's the science of polymers. Now, Rob, put your spoon down, dip your fingers in there, and pull that out. Oh, cool. And you have I got gooey, a gooey, gooey worms, worms, or kids will say, ooh, you made intestines. So, a Can lot of fun. But actually, it's the science of polymers, so it's a great way to bring in lots of fun science. Now, let's put the black light okay, on. We got to do it hurry because we're running out of time, okay. so let's make it so really let's quick. So, let's put our black light on are fluorescent atomic things and you can get it an, an idea of how this okay. is going to look. Okay, give me a quick because we're okay. out of time. Can you see that? If we can, so there's all our Halloween Very science cool. oh, yeah. experiment great and you can see that. how that it glows. Right. So science can be a great fun A lot Halloween. of fun. Terry, okay. thanks so much well, for stopping by. Well, thank you so much, Rob. It. I always have fun. And